If you remember, ladies and gentlemen, the woman did not even get arrested until there was a national movement to arrest her. The sheriff comes out, and basically defends his actions not to immediately arrest this woman and says, I'm just following Florida law. I don't have to like Florida law, but I'm going to follow it. She gets arrested eventually, reluctantly. All of a sudden, the charges are dropped. And then the statute is cited by way of context that you have to prove a depraved mind. It doesn't take much to prove a depraved mind. As a matter of fact, in that state, the murder alone can be evidence of a depraved mind. Look it up, it's under the case law. In addition to that, a depraved mind can also have what's called contextual evidence, meaning things you did prior, such as calling people the N word or abusing their children. That can be utilized also. 